First of all, one official information for Saturday. Uh, we will have both relays tomorrow, Saturday, due to the deep temperature forecast for Sunday. Relay men, 2.30, and relay women, 16.10 local time. Welcome and congratulations to the winners of the Pursuit Competition Women. First position, Gabriela Sukalova, Czech Republic. Second position, Kaiser Mekarin in Finland. And third position, Marie Doran Abert, France. Gabriela, 12th World Cup win of your career, fourth World Cup win of the season. Two here in Presque Isle. Sport wise, you like it very much here. Hello, thank you for the question. I have to say it's awesome, like yesterday, but I don't understand what happened. Uh, it's very nice to sit here again and maybe the atmosphere is a little bit easier than you are, for example, somewhere where there is a lot of spectators. So, But I think I'm not the type uh, of the human who realize uh, how much people are there, but of course it's not so noisy and maybe it helps us. Can you tell us about shooting stage three? About what brought you to these three misses and what made the conditions for many people at this stage so difficult? Uh, well, it's hard to say. I was uh, maybe... I was not concentrated for the shooting after before this uh, before this uh, standing position so i don't know my legs started to shake and maybe i started to be afraid of the wind because it was a little bit stronger than before so sometimes it happens but i was very happy for the last shooting will you compete uh, at the relay tomorrow and what's your program then for the time until the world championships uh, yeah, I was asking to my coach uh, when I'm going to race tomorrow, but uh, I didn't have problems during the races, so I don't see the reasons why I don't start tomorrow. So I'm looking forward to stay on the start line again. And what's uh, your program until the World Championships after coming home? A special training program? Uh, I'm gonna fly to the Slovenia directly after this uh, races. So uh, after that, we are going to have a preparation there, and from this preparation, I'm, I'm gonna fly directly to the Oslo, and then to the Hante, and then we are going to have the most important races of the season. That's Czech uh, Championship in my hometown. I hope I'm gonna be in good shape for this. <laughs> being there in yellow. Um, Kaiser, yesterday fifth, today second. Happy, happy with your competitions here? Uh, thanks, it's uh, nice to be back on the podium. And yeah, uh, so I'm just really happy to get a really good race before the world champs are, world champs are coming. So <coughs> yeah, I am happy. Now you are fourth in total score and also everything fine with your form physically and also with the shooting performance. Yeah, now I am healthy again. I had some problems in the rope holding and Antarselva with my health and it still took some time after Antarselva to that I was able to train well again. So it was a long time and a difficult time in the middle of the season. and. Uh, but uh, I'm happy to find my form back again and now everything seems to be okay for the World Champs if, if I just stay healthy. And what's on the program for the next two weeks? Mm, I go home tomorrow, we don't have a relay team here. And or I'm home Sunday evening <laughs> actually, it's a long traveling and so I think I need some more days to to recover from uh, this tour here and then I train in Kontiolahti and probably a little bit in Vuokatti but anyway stay in Finland. Marie, have you thought you could manage the podium with five penalty loops today? Uh, no, before the race um, it wasn't uh, in my plan to make 15 penalties 
Um, but uh, on the last shoot, when I, um, I go on the track uh, for the last um, loop, uh, the coach uh, tell me, told me that uh, I'm just five and just few seconds uh, with the podium and I was in a very good shape today. So, yeah, I think it was possible. You looked extremely strong on the course. Do you not feel any fatigue after these two strenuous weeks? Uh, yesterday I was uh, I wasn't in a very good shape. I, I, I don't have very uh, good sensation on the track, but today it was very nice. It's very strange um, with all the races and all the the travel and the jet lag, and I don't know in my body. It's sometimes sometimes it's good, sometimes it's uh, uh, not very good, and. I don't have uh, any um, explanation about that. I just want to, yeah, I hope I will be good <laughs> in a slow too. How strong have you felt today the temperature? Yeah, um, since the, the start of the season we didn't have a um, very um, um, strong temperature. Um, yes, it's hard and in the hand and in the, the foot. And yeah, we we are not um, habitués. <laughs> I don't have the word in English. Used. Used. To. Yeah, we are we are not used to to run under this uh, temperature, but uh, we have to do with that. What are your plans for tomorrow? Uh, I, I will not run the relay. Um, I I will go back home tomorrow, and I think I will be at home on Sunday evening, like Gaza. And after. Uh, 10 days break with uh, all family and after just three days in the training camp with the other girl, other French girl in France, in Prémanon and after we fly to Oslo just before the World Championship. Okay, thank you very much. Do we have other questions? Nope. Thank you.